Metro stretch your ass up and make some drums, nigga. Hot tea, hot tea, hot tea, oh. hot tea, hot tea. All right, so they saying Metro Boomin and Twenty One Savage had a little run in last night. Y'all know Twenty One Savage is basically Team Drake, and of course Metro seems to be Team Future and Team Kendrick. He gotta die. Put that shit on Brenda. Yo, Mike ain't working, bro. Now, hold on. I need y'all to peep. Metro was trying to get added to the live, and y'all see he typed in OVO Savage because I guess he felt like 21 wasn't trying to add him because of the Drake shit, right? Yo, Mike ain't working, bro. You on that po-ass Wi-Fi. Yo, Mike ain't working, my nigga. Oh, you was talking shit? Bitch, get off my live, bitch. I ain't even see all the other comments. Fuck wrong with this nigga. I'm from the block, this nigga. Metro, shut your whole ass up and make some drums, nigga. That's right. You better ride for your light skin, King 21. Hey, the allegations is behind us right now. We waiting for summer 2024, nigga. 21 said, I'm about to pop out with Drake. Fuck that. <laughs> we going on another tour. We about to do another joint album. That's all Drake need right now. He like 21. We got to get back in the studio. <laughs> we got to get back in the studio, man. That nigga Kendrick said, I got to go to Atlanta to get a hit. The nigga wasn't lying. We going to get back in the studio. We going to get every... Poppin' nigga who wasn't dissing me from Atlanta on this album, and we gonna rock out. And no beats by Metro, nigga. <laughs> hey. Now, I don't need people to take this too seriously. 21 and Metro are like brothers from what I know, so they can joke like this. I know a lot of people gonna say, oh, look at 21, dick sucking Drake, da da da. Bro, 21 has been the mediator in this whole situation. 21 has been the nigga who has kept it fair and has kept it even. So I don't want to see niggas out here trying to act like 21 is going against Atlanta, siding with Drake. Because I see some of y'all niggas trying to do that. It ain't just the West Coast versus East Coast shit. Nah, y'all know it's been a Atlanta versus everybody movement for a long time too. And so I don't want people trying to come at 21 because he cool with Drake. And it's like, y'all heard what Kendrick said. That nigga Drake just coming down to Atlanta trying to steal the sauce. And I think if Metro and Drake ever piece it up, it would probably be because of 21 Savage. Hell, I might even say the same thing with Future. I just don't know how close 21 and Future are. Some of y'all from Atlanta will have to let me know that. Like, do y'all think 21 and Future have a really good relationship? I really don't know. But I just feel like everybody from Atlanta knows that 21 is kind of like an even kill kind of guy. Very chill. Very laid back. He ain't no sucker. He ain't no pussy. But he tends to kind of like go about a lot of this hip hip hop shit in a very mature way. I noticed that about 21. I've never seen 21 get on live and get rah-rah with niggas. Even when it's smoke, he still comes about it in a very mature way. Even when he was going back and forth with WAC 100, he wasn't trying to crash out on the internet. I saw the same thing when he was talking to uh Meek Mill's ex-Dream Chaser. I don't know if y'all remember when that guy forgot his name, but he Dean, that guy Dean, he was going live and he was trying to out meek but he kept bringing 21 savage name in and saying oh this shit happened back in the day with 21 savage and even in that situation 21 was keeping it very calm very cool he wasn't really like getting out of character we never see that from 21 and that's why a lot of people when they say this generation needs a, a elder statesman in hip-hop they always say 21 savage because 21 Savage seems to be cool with a lot of people, and he seems to always be level-headed. 
So in this situation, I think he was just joking with Metro. And um, I don't feel like 21 is necessarily taking sides when it comes to Drake. Now, with that said, y'all know Drake does have a statue of 21's head at his house. All right. If y'all don't believe me, go watch my video. Why doesn't 21 stand up for Drake? Something like that. You know, I was really just trolling on that video, having a good time, having a good laugh. I think a lot of people enjoyed it. But obviously, 21 and Drake have a really good, like, brotherly relationship. But I don't feel like his relationship with Drake would ever cause him to turn his back on anybody from Atlanta. Like I said, I feel like he is always staying in the middle and staying even keel. So let me know what y'all think about this. Like the video and subscribe. I will see y'all next time. Peace. Hey, nigga, donate. Hit the super chat. Scan the PayPal. Hit the cash app. Thank you. Have a blessed day.